Davian Mitchell, welcome to Two K TV. So excited. Get ready, everyone, for Tuesday afternoon NBA action on 2K Sports. Moments away, it'll be the Philadelphia 76ers going up against the Washington Wizards. Kevin Harlan here, and I'm joined by Greg Anthony, Clark Kellogg, and David Aldridge, who's reporting from the sidelines. D.A., take it away. Kevin, thanks. Last season, some people called on Joel Embiid to be more... David, he is showing that maturity. Thanks for that report. All teams tonight, Greg, love to push the ball up the floor, even off made shots. You know, trying to find an opening before the half-court D can set up. I think you're going to see more and more of that every year. I agree. So a look at the starters for the Wizards. Hachimura and Bryant are in the middle. Russell Westbrook out there with Bradley Beal. And it's Abdiya in at the three spot. And for the 76ers, Harrison and Bead together in the middle. Curry is out there with Simmons. And it's Green in at the three, the small forward. Boy, the floor awareness and passing ability of MB, very impressive. And he continues to grow as a passer. Hachimura finds Westbrook. Back to Hachimura. Pass to Westbrook. And Philadelphia grabs the miss. Those are chances almost always you can rely on him to get you two points, but the D just enough to keep him out of rhythm. Here's Curry with the three. The basket good off the assist from Simmons. He's gaining more and more confidence over time from deep. Seth Curry proving he's got touch from out there. Pass to Avdia. Back to Beal. The train. It's hauled in by Harris. Not quite enough defense that time around. Just lucky he was off. And, and what a factor Ben Simmons is on the floor. Does so much for this team in every facet of the game. He's a triple-double threat whenever he suits up. And, and once he got to the 10, I, I think he was surprised to find himself that wide open. Well, this early, they should be showing a lot more energy on defense. It's not there. Finally. After all those planks, someone comes through for him. Well, you knew it eventually was going to happen. I mean, my goodness, a tight start to this one. But maybe that'll ignite some more buckets to be made. Good work there as it goes. And sometimes people forget just how young Ben Simmons is, Greg. This is just the beginning for him. I mean, and that's what fans are missing about Simmons, his age. I mean, you can worry about his shot, but he has a long time to figure it out. He could end up having a Jason Kidd type of career where he becomes a solid shooter later on. And hitting the mid-range jumper here early gives the defense just another thing to think about. Well, they better be thinking about him. I mean, we know how dangerous he is. Now here is Harris. And slam dunk by Harris. Not settling for the layup. Sometimes you got to go strong, and Harris gets the chance to stuff it there. He didn't let it slip by him. Westbrook feeling it out a bit. Passes it to Hachimura. Simmons. 
Six to shoot. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. That one on Harris. And Hachimura's given name, Rui, means fortress in Japanese. And that's what he looks like out there. He's worked hard in the weight room, sports a solid frame with a terrific core and, and that great lower body strength. free throw is good and you combine Hachimura's power with that 7 2 wingspan Greg he's physically built to succeed in a positionless NBA and add to that Kevin he's got solid athleticism along with a versatile skill set Hachimura still needs to work on creating off the dribble shooting the jump shot with consistency but with his work ethic there's a good chance he turns those into strength so he gets them both and although he started playing the game later in life, Hachimura has picked it up well and exciting young player to watch. Now here's Curry. Back to Embiid. Again, Philadelphia. Boy, he is looking confident. Love how they're using him so far. And you know what? They're going to keep using him. I mean, he'll be the centerpiece of their offense today. You can bank on that. Westbrook can't get it to go. And so Green will bring it up for the Philadelphia 76ers. And first quarter, we're about three and a half minutes in. And slam dunk by Harris. Yeah, they call him dancing Danny Green, and you can see why. Excellent offensive instincts there. So timeout called here, the first for Washington. And how about the defensive impact Embiid has on the floor? He's a great rim protector who can swipe an errant pass every so often. Yeah, I agree with you, Greg. I mean, he's just so big. He's mammoth. I mean, he's not only tall and long, he's deep, too. He's a thick guy. So he's an excellent rim protector, discourages inside attempts at a high rate, um, clogs up the paint. That length is a huge asset. And then his foot movement, his, his agility for a guy of his size is pretty impressive, too. Here's what Philadelphia is going with right now. Dwight out. He's checked in for Embiid. Matisse Thibel comes in for Danny Green. Shake Milton, he's checked in for Curry. And George Hills subbed in for Harris. And here is Milton after the three-pointer from Bradley Beal. And you can see the defenders afraid to kind of get in his way a lot of times when he's on his way to the basket. But on that one, they were there. Neto can't get it to go. The 76ers leading by six. Here's Simmons. Chalk up two there. Nice pass here to set that basket up. The Wizards have gone three of seven from the field since we've gotten underway. Now here is Smith. 129 left in the first quarter of the game. Great D that time from Howell. The 76ers have gone an incredible eight of nine from the field. A nice shot by Simmons. Yeah, the chemistry has been terrific. Really impressed with their offensive execution. You know, the defense has really been kept off balance because of the outstanding passes. Four straight field goals have been made off an assist. Now the pass to Beal. Goes up on the wing. That's good on the jump shot. Beal's got five now. And this is Beal's role. He's out here to score the ball. And he does it at a high rate. to Simmons to the paint here's Howard and he gets the whistle two free throws coming up and you don't ever want to get into the habit of letting the offense get to the rim yeah I couldn't agree with you more I mean that's the message they were sending with that foul nothing easy inside first trip to the free throw line for him in this one Shooting two. That one is off. You know what? Still a consistent double-double threat. Every game is Howard wanting to prove how valuable he is. 
And some changes here for the 76ers. Cork Moss, he's checked in for Ben Simmons. And Maxi subbed in for Shake Milton. Robin Lopez is checked in for the Wizards. I've been playing this game for a very long time, man. Just trying to make a player that looks like me, but not really that close. It's, it's really special that I actually get to have some. 2K Sports welcomes you to the following presentation of the WNBA. Welcome, everyone. This is the WNBA on 2K Sports. Moments away, it'll be the Las Vegas Aces going up against the Connecticut Sun. From the 2K booth with Brian Banifatemi and Tim Swartz, I'm Blake Suniga. Thanks for coming along. Tip-off goes to Connecticut. Well, the WNBA has certainly adapted to the modern era as the league allows fans to stream select games on social media. You know, how important is that, guys? I think it's huge, Blake. Social media has grown more and more over the years. So I credit the WNBA for following the trends. To grow the game, you got to go where the fans are. Many are on social media. So to me, it's a perfect partnership. And streaming is very user-friendly, guys. So even non-tech-savvy fans like you two can easily access the games. I know I'll be watching on my smartphone, tablet, and computer all season long. Great defense right there to prevent one of the best finishers in the league from converting in close. Pass to Jones. Jones left side. Four on the clock. Up top, January. Shoots over Young. Can't hit that one. And Las Vegas the other way now. A little over a minute gone here in the first quarter. Outside, Williams. And here's Thomas. Pass to January. Here's Jones. Goes back up. And that's two points on the layup. Well, with the developed understanding of the game, Jones uses timing and body control to inhale rebounds. Well, the Bahamas has produced some great basketball players, and John Quill Jones is just the latest to come from the country of about 400,000. Jones was classmates and is still close friends with an NBA star from her hometown, Buddy Heald. In high school, they would work out together at 6 a.m. before class. Now here's Jones. Thomas outside. Pass to Bonner from deep. Unable to get that one to go. The shots aren't dropping yet. They've missed four of their first five shots. Down low. Out of bounds. It'll be Sun Ball. Here in the first with just under two and a half minutes played so far. Now here's Thomas. January outside. Jones left side. Five on the clock. Thomas down low. Gray defending. 
Yeah, she's not necessarily a strong interior presence, but she's got to finish those chances when she has them. And yep, it's good. Well, Jones and Heald made a bet with each other who would go higher in the draft. The winner? Neither. Both were six overall picks. Yeah, Heald, a big fan, even rocks Jones' jersey courtside at WNBA games, watching his friend play. In terms of what Jones means to her home country, Buddy Heald said it best. John Quell's a blessing for the Bahamas and the league. She's really been a great inspiration for everybody back home. Nice work inside. Hard to get that one to go over the bigger defender. Well, it was never going to be easy. A little artistry on the inside. Call it maybe a Rembrandt. Now here's Thomas looking for her first basket still in this one. Bonner with it. Williams there. Good work there as it goes. An adaptable scorer, Bonner shows the ability to outduel opponents on contact finishes. Wilson outside. Pass to Young. And here's Cambage. Three on January with the SWAT. Here we go, one on one. Thomas, no good. January with the steal. Back to Thomas. January outside. A little in the hoop for her this quarter. She still hasn't gotten one, not one, to fall. The Aces with another miss. And here the Sun. Thomas. Fast break, Las Vegas. Here's Young. Over to the left wing. Stolen by Bonner. The Sun pushing it up now. And here's Jasmine Thomas for three. Las Vegas grabs the miss. Well, offensively speaking, it has been a tough, tough quarter for her. That one goes in. When Wilson gets the rock down low, it's almost automatic. So effective. Close in. Thomas outside. Pass to Jones. side she's gonna win some points with the coach if she keeps boxing out as well as she did right there shot clock and game clock one second differential gray right side and John Quell Jones pulls it down yeah remember that I mean, that's not an opportunity she fails to convert very often pass to Bonner there's the triple he can't get that one And still a close game as the first quarter comes to a close. Aces ahead. They're up by two. Let's take a quick break, and then it's on to the second quarter after this.